In the heart of the Horn of Africa, a gem sits nestled between the shimmering Red Sea and the rugged Eastern African plains. This gem is Eritrea, a land of diverse cultures, rich history, and breathtaking landscapes. Today, we embark on an exquisite journey through the top 10 must-see attractions in this enchanting land. Number one on our list is the vibrant capital city, Asmara. Often compared to a beautiful Italian city frozen in time, Asmara is a UNESCO World Heritage Site. The city is an architectural marvel, showcasing an array of styles from Art Deco to Futurist. These buildings whisper tales of the Italian colonial era, making Asmara a living museum where history and culture converge. Second, we venture to the ancient port city of Masawa. Known as the Pearl of the Red Sea, Masawa is a testament to the Ottoman and Egyptian influences that once permeated Eritrea. The city's old town, with its coral stone buildings and labyrinthine streets, is a captivating testament to the resilience of Eritrean heritage. Next, we journey to the third must-see attraction, the Dalak Archipelago. This cluster of over 100 islands is a paradise for nature lovers. Its pristine beaches, untouched coral reefs, and ancient archaeological sites offer a glimpse into a world untouched by the hustle and bustle of modern life. Fourth on our list is the Kohaito Ruins. Once a thriving city in the Aksumite Kingdom, Kohaito now stands as a silent sentinel, its ancient pillars and rock art narrating tales of a grand past. Fifth, we find ourselves at the Imperial Palace in Misawa. This Ottoman-era building is a magnificent display of Islamic architecture, its intricate details narrating tales of a time when sultans and emperors walked its halls. Our sixth stop is the Debris Bizan Monastery. Perched atop the highest peak in the Eritrean Highlands, this Orthodox Christian monastery is not only a place of devout worship, but also a treasure trove of ancient manuscripts and religious artifacts. Next, we journey to the seventh must-see attraction, the Nakfa area. The rugged landscape of Nakfa bears silent witness to Eritrea's struggle for independence. Today, it stands as a symbol of the nation's resilient spirit. Eighth on our list is the St. Mariam Deret Shrine in Karen. Carved from a single baobab tree, this shrine is a testament to the unique blend of Christian and traditional African religious practices in Eritrea. Our ninth stop brings us to the National Museum in Asmara. Home to a wealth of archaeological and ethnographic exhibits, this museum offers a comprehensive insight into Eritrea's rich and diverse history. Finally, we conclude our journey at the 10th must-see attraction, the Matera Rock Art Site. These ancient etchings, nestled amidst the rugged mountains of Eritrea, are a window into the lives of the region's earliest inhabitants. Each attraction in Eritrea is a chapter in its rich tapestry of history, culture, and natural beauty. They stand as testaments to the resilience, diversity, and vibrancy of this enchanting land, beckoning travelers from far and wide to immerse themselves in their captivating tales. As we journey through these 10 must-see attractions, we not only discover Eritrea, but also a part of ourselves.